So when we look at a mine today, you can have your largest impact on the mine site by really tackling how do we electrify, how do we decarbonize the haulage fleet. The simplest form, the, the trolley assist, is really utilizing an external energy source to bring energy on board the truck. So the truck itself is already an electric drive truck. It uses an onboard diesel engine with an alternator to generate that electricity to propel the truck. With trolley assist, what we're doing now is actually bringing in energy from the grid to propel that truck through the means of an overhead power line. So what that really allows for is that diesel engine can now be idled down and we're no longer actually burning diesel to propel the truck up the ramp, but we're using that, that clean energy. So in the case of BC, hydroelectricity has a very low carbon intensity uh, to that electricity. So for every haul cycle, we're just burning that much less diesel. We're putting that much less CO2 into the atmosphere, uh, which is really great for you know, the local environment and the global environment. So with Copper Mountain, the seven trucks they have today, um, they're looking at a 30% carbon reduction just with those trucks. And as they're looking to grow the amount of trucks they have on trolley over the coming years, they're hoping to significantly increase that as well to go beyond 50%. The local branch here in Kamloops, the service teams, they actually went in, they converted those trucks, they installed all the hardware on them to allow them to operate on the trolley line. And they're well supported through the, the, the parts team here at the branch as well. In the very near future, we're already looking at haulage with battery technology, hydrogen fuel cell technology, but we're also looking at other technologies as well. So how do we actually substitute diesel today for a cleaner burning fuel? The haul trucks provide the, the biggest opportunity now to decarbonize, um, but also looking at all that other equipment that's in the mine today, the shovels. Uh, so we offer, you know, electrified shovels. So you don't have to have a diesel engine in your shovel that's working. Um, as well as the drills, you know, electrifying the drills, really looking at all of these different assets that are in your mind today and how can we decarbonize them? How can we electrify them? Everyone has a responsibility or role to play in decarbonization, you know, whether it's our personal lives or the businesses or the communities that we work with. By being able to decarbonize, it's just putting that much into the environment. It's that much change on global warming that we can actually have for future generations.